Hi and welcome back to Digital Toolcase. In this video I want to show you again Human Writer because in the last few days they released a new uh, version, it's the 4.4 beta. On the 22nd of May they released this new version and as you can see in their Facebook group uh, they have now support for GPT 3.5 Turbo, GPT 3.5 DaVinci and even GPT 4 if you have access to GPT 4 APIs with OpenAI. They also added extra custom fields to allow extra user prompts for headings, for paragraphs and for FAQs you can now uh, generate multiple articles uh, uh, with added bullet points. You can export to XML format so you can upload, for example, to WordPress directly with some tools. You have uh, tooltips added and some bug fixes. For example, credits now it's called articles per month. But uh, what uh, Human Writer is, I already made a review. You can find it here on my channel if you want. Uh, Human Writer is free to use, is a free. AI writing tool. This is a really interesting project and here you can see a table of comparison between a human writer and other competitors. But in order to use it you obviously need your OpenAI API keys so you don't pay this platform, this human writer, but you pay uh, for the words you generate directly to OpenAI. I already showed this part on my previous video, so again, you can go and watch it. I just want to show you now some of these uh, little uh, updates with the Human Writer. Uh, as you can see now, here it's called Articles per Month, and you have two 1000 articles per month uh, at maximum at the moment you can generate because you can also use these multiple articles generators so if you want to generate many many articles you can do it uh, at the same time but with this limit 2000 articles per month now i will try to generate a new single article so we can see uh, some of the new options we have in Human Writer. The title for this uh, test article is uh, Exploring Different Aromatherapy Shents for Shower Therapy. I could insert my headings here. I will not do it. You, you can do it if you want, uh, but uh, I will uh, use another option. I want to add FAQs in this article and then by clicking on these advanced options, as you can see now, we have something more. For example, I can choose between GPT 3.5 Turbo, DaVinci or GPT 4. I will use Turbo in this case. This is, as always, the cheapest one to use. I want bullet points. I don't remember if this option was already here but anyway as you can see you can choose to generate bullet points randomly in uh, one section or on every section of your article i will choose this uh, one section randomly the content length uh, let's say i want a 2000 words article i think it's good Another uh, new update is the language because uh, now you can write in pretty any language with a human writer and this is good. Maybe I will try even in Italian in another video and I will choose English in this case. The tone of voice I want to use, uh, let's say, professional for this article and here I can insert uh, keywords. For keywords uh, I will use a phrase, my preferred uh, SEO optimizing tool. I already found some of these uh, uh, LSI and NLP keywords to insert in my article. Okay, perfect. Uh, I want to also insert these uh, questions as keywords. I, I want to use them as they were keywords because I want to try even this thing. Okay. Uh, I can choose to generate headings from keywords and I will use this option. I find it interesting. I can choose to avoid AI detection, but output quality might be lower, so I will not use this one. And 
Even these ones are new. Additional prompt for headings, additional prompt for content, additional prompt for FAQs. I don't really know what to write here. Uh, I know these fields uh, uh, are for the global article, so you can give uh, additional instructions to guide AI in generating article headings, but this prompt uh, will uh, influence any single heading in your article, so I don't really know how it's uh, a good use for this one. I will not use these fields, but anyway, you can try them and you can test how it works. Perfect. I'm ready to generate this uh, 2000 words article with the GPT 3.5 Turbo. Let me go on my OpenAI account. So as you can see, I am at zero at the moment. So we can then see how much it will cost to generate an article like this with Human writer, I just need to click on generate and wait until this article is finished. Okay, good, my article is ready. And as you can see here, I have even an estimated cost. It's uh, 1.5 cents for this article. Later, I will check if this is correct into my OpenAI site. Uh, anyway, now let's open this article so we can take a look. I will copy all this article and uh, paste it in a phrase so we can uh, see it better. As you can see, it's uh, 2,653 words. I also have a slug ready for me. I have a meta title and I have a meta description. Let's take a look. It's a uh, too long for my taste and for Google. <laughs> anyway, uh, you also have a meta description. You have an FAQ section here. Uh, I remember the last time uh, there was a little bug uh, with the FAQ. I'm curious to see if these are the same FAQs uh, I have here. Yes, it seems uh, these are the same uh, FAQs I have here in my article. Anyway, let me copy this article here into phrase. Okay, perfect. And as you can see, I have a 77% topic score here. It's uh, perfect because my competitor's average is 34%. 0.8% and once you are let's say a 30% above your competitor's average you are good you don't need to always go to 100 here you can even do over optimization if you go to 100 before i copied all the terms all these words i think make sense for this article so i'm pretty happy with this uh, topic score result and uh, now if you want you can uh, read this article uh, let's read it together while i scroll it really slowly so you can stop the video if you want and uh, read by yourself. Let me uh, show you the title, Shower Aromatherapy, a comprehensive guide to natural scents and their benefits. The introduction is always too long for my taste. I always prefer a one or two maximum paragraphs. Anyway, it's uh, easy uh, editable. The benefits of aromatherapy in your daily shower routine then we have uh, exploring the therapeutic effects of natural ingredients in shower steamers, how to create a spa-like experience uh, with aromatherapy shower steamers. I don't know how you say spa in English. Uh, anyway, it's uh, spa in Italian. Uh, and uh, here I also have some uh, bullet points. Uh, I asked to generate uh, some bullet points in a random place in this article. I can uh, format them as uh, bullet points here. Okay, just to show you how you can do it. The health benefits of using sustainable ingredients in your shower routine. 
the refreshing fragrance of flower shower steamers and aromatherapy delight. I see it's been quite creative with these H2s, using essential oil blends for a strong scent and direct stream of aromatherapy. What are the benefits of shower steamers and how do they work? Maximizing the benefits of aromatherapy with hot water and direct running water. And then I have my frequently asked questions about shower aromatherapy and natural smells. Here I have these three and then I have these other ones, a very big FAQ section, I will say. Okay, perfect. Uh, well, it's not a bad article, obviously, as always, you will need to edit it a little bit, maybe shorten some parts. I would like to see even some H3s for these articles. I like a structure where you have uh, H2s and H3s and sometimes even H4s because it's easier to read and I think it's good but if you have something like a phrase you can for example use commands and write something like generate a good H3 for the above paragraph and I'm curious to see if it works AI command Okay, I have my H3, as you can see, I can copy it here, for example, and now I have an H3 for this section of my article. Enjoy the benefits of aromatherapy through flower shower steamers in this case. So this is how this new updated version of Human Writer works. Not too bad. I think they are doing a great job here because for just 1.5 cent you can have an article like this and I used the GPT 3.5 Turbo, it's the cheapest one, it's not the best one in my opinion to generate these articles. I will choose GPT 4 for an higher quality but even DaVinci 003 is pretty good. Let me go here on my OpenAI account, let me uh, update the page so we can see it's saying uh, two cents uh, it's really nothing for an article like this uh, yes you may need to edit a little bit but i think it's pretty good and i think they will add many more options uh, let me go here on updates uh, just to see if uh, there is something I've missed. I don't think so. Then if I want to, for example, download article, as you can see, you have HTML, doc, txt and XML, upload to cloud, push to WordPress if you connect your WordPress site. And that's all. You can find obviously the link to this tool in the description. It's uh, free to use this platform, at least at the moment. So you can try it by yourself uh, and you will not go broke for sure with this uh, cost for generating these uh, long form articles. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if so, please click on the like button and subscribe to my channel. If you want to watch my entire human writer review, you can click here. Thank you very much for watching until now and I'll see you soon in the next one.